Man, welcome back PTSD, it's your boy LC. Boy, talk to you, boy, come on. Uh, this is Rich Homie Corn. song. Hey. It's called Song Cry. Rich Homie was a big influence, bro. Truly a legend, bro. Mm -hmm. As far as the music scene and everything, bro. So, and he done dropped some songs after he done passed away and everything. They dropped some music, bro. So, we gonna see what, what's going on. Yeah, we had seen that y'all request this in the comment section. K-pop there tomorrow, by the way. If any other, by the way. Wait on the K-pop, we're doing all K-pop tomorrow. So we're going to get these American artists out of the rain today. So, yeah. let's do it. Let's get straight to it. Let's do it. Yeah, bro. I don't know what you got on that camera, but that leg's looking a little atchy to me. Quan's name has been etched in stone as Atlanta hip-hop royalty, and his memory will be forever cherished and celebrated. We, the members of the Atlanta City Council, on behalf of the citizens of the city of Atlanta, do hereby proclaim this day as Rich Homie Quan Memorial Day in our fair city. And on behalf of over 108,000 residents that call the city of South Fulton home, we hereby proclaim today, Tuesday, September 17th, 2024, as the Qantas Lamar Appreciation Day, and may his legacy forever live on. Hey, this is a good person. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of my songs y'all don't take serious in a way, but... I want y'all to turn this one up.
that chain. Oh, Tell him look yeah. at it here. To that rest, nigga. You know what it took to get here. Can't hit a block without the shot. You know what it took to get here. Stand down hard time. You know what it took to get Nah, that's, that's my favorite song by Rich Homie, Rich yeah, Takers. Rich Takers. Yeah, that ain't crazy. One. And then Walk Through. Yeah, Rich, yeah, nah, Rich Takers, my favorite one. What I'm going to say, uh, that's a black repass for you. Mm -hmm. Everybody be sad at the funeral. Mm -hmm. Turn up at the repass. Yeah. Your favorite food, done no. Yeah. But, you know what I'm saying? Might pour one up for you and some more. Yeah. You feel me? But you know, yeah. I'm glad he had a good service. You know what I'm saying? They represented my boy well. Cause your legacy is everything that happened after you pass away and how people talk about you, bro. It ain't about the all the other stuff. The way people speak about you is gonna what? Be positive the way your kids and your, your family, the way they bring up your name. Cause they gonna be the ones that remember you, not the people on IG, bro. Yeah. Death is the final part of life. You know what I'm saying? Everybody gonna tell you that you're gonna be remembered through the life that you live and death is just the final stage. Mm. Legends is made when they die. That's why they always say legends never die. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Cause how people talk about you after your death is how you live forever. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Most people gonna live through like they quotes, they words, they books and just their family members' memories. Mm. You feel me? Especially like when they was famous or like they left the impact, you feel me? So in Atlanta that boy was like real big, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So Shit. For rich homie, I'm gonna get that bit ten. Man. You gonna get that bit ten. Ten, ten, ten. Yeah. It was a good song too, bro. He always make good music. I don't know what why people stop listening to him, cause I never stop. You feel me? Especially I remember when I was a kid, my pops had the C D and we used to always tell him what songs to play and everything. But my pops would go to the C D man. And he'll have me and Kyle listen to all the CDs and make sure we got the ones we wanted. And then we didn't have Bluetooth you in the truck. You know what I'm saying? Because we were burning the songs on the CDs that we yeah. wanted on that bit. So we just picking our own CD, basically. Yeah. Till we got phones, then we started making our own playlists and shit. You know what I'm saying? Popeyes, really. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. man. You feel me? Just, you know, take everything day by day. You feel me? I think Rich Homie had left a great legacy. And I think he was a great influence for a lot of people. Yeah. That being said, man, we're going to roll to 100K, man. Uh, we thank y'all. We thank God most importantly, and we appreciate y'all for praying and staying down. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. You feel me? One, one last thing. I think what was cool about him and, like, Nipsey or, like, people who died and they got, like, a lot of footage mm -hmm. of them because he did a lot of YouTube videos. Yeah, he did. So you could go watch, like, Hella people YouTube channels and like Rich Homie Quine yeah, yeah. gonna be featured in the video and he gonna be in that bit talking like yeah. the whole vid. You could, bro, you his house saying? tour that Avery B did yeah. with him was probably one of the coolest vids I've seen. Yeah, that cool. And you yeah. can see his cars and shit too and like mm -hmm. all that. So and just see more of his personality and like his kids. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So and uh, Richard. Yeah, yeah, Richard. Yeah, Richard yeah. always he always had. Is it? Man, they probably got a year worth of vids on his channel. So. Right. With the only thing that model is not touching. Yeah, that jumped me funny. So, bro. yeah. But, thank y'all for the second time. I tried to watch it once again, man. I pray it's y'all way out there every day. With that being said, man. Yeah, sir. Ski. We gone. Peace and love, man. Hood.